this lesson, you will see an animal or animals in each of the numbered locations in the cube. You should also imagine the same animal or animals at the same location in your own room cube, the room in which you are now located. All the animals will be located either in a corner or at the center of a wall. Let's start with location zero at the back wall. Look both at the screen and at the back wall of the room in which you are now located. See a cat at the center of the back wall. In this case, at the center of the wall in front of the double doors. Here you see a cat on the screen at the back wall. Imagine that this cat is always at the zero location, the back wall of your own room cube. Turn and look at the back wall, location zero. Now, imagine the cat at the back wall of your own room cube. Later, if I say zero or location zero, you say cat. If I say cat, you say zero. Next, look at location one, the back left corner of the cube on the screen. See a giraffe at location one. If you were ever to see a giraffe at the back left corner of your own room cube, you would never forget it. Look over your left shoulder to location one, the back left corner of the room in which you are now located. Imagine the giraffe at the back left corner of your own room cube. Later, if I say one, you say giraffe. If I say giraffe, you say one. Next, look at location two, the left wall of the cube on the screen. See a dog at location two. Now, look over at location two, the left wall of the room in which you are now located. Imagine the dog at the left wall of your own room cube. Later, if I say two, you say dog. If I say dog, you say two. Next, look at location three, the front left corner of the cube on the screen. See an alligator at location three. Now look at location three, the front left corner of your own room. Imagine the alligator at the front left corner of your own room cube. Later, if I say three, you say alligator. If I say alligator, you say three. Next, look at location four, the front wall of the cube on the screen. See an elephant at location four in front of the fireplace. Can you imagine an elephant at the front wall of any room? How could you ever forget that? Now look straight ahead to location four, the front wall of your own room. Imagine the elephant at the front wall of your own room. Later, if I say four, you say elephant. And if I say elephant, you say four. Next, look at location five, the front right corner of the cube on the screen. See a bear at location five. Now, look at location five, the front right corner of your own room. Imagine the bear at the front right corner of your own room. Later, if I say five, you say bear. If I say bear, you say five. So far, you have seen just one animal at each location. Location zero, the back wall, cat. Location one, the back left corner, giraffe. Location two, the left wall, dog. Location three, the front left corner, alligator. Location four, the front wall, elephant. And location five, the front right corner, bear. In locations six and seven, you will see more than one animal in each location. Look at location six, the right wall of the cube on the screen. 
see the frogs at location 6. Now look over at location 6, the right wall of the room in which you are now located. Imagine the frogs at the right wall of your own room. Later, if I say 6, you say frogs. If I say frogs, you say 6. And last, look at location 7, the back right corner of the cube on the screen. See the cats at location 7. Remember, at location 0, the back wall, you saw just one cat. At location 7, the back right corner, you see cats. You have now seen one animal in each of the numbered locations from 0 around to 5. And you have seen multiple animals at locations 6 and 7. Knowing where these animals are located, with absolute certainty and speed, is the most important part of this course on music theory. Use your learning guide to review this lesson before continuing to the next lesson. Remember, the course is designed for 100% retention. Please don't continue until you are absolutely sure you can look at any numbered location between 0 and 7 and know the animal or animals located there. Then, be certain you can look at any animal or animals, cat, giraffe, dog, alligator, elephant, bear, frogs, or cats, sequentially or randomly, and know the numbered location in the cube. This ends this lesson.